Got a bloody flat tire. I ran over this. I ran over that. That got stuck in me tire. I don't know what the fuck it's from. I hope this I hope no one's just gone and thrown it in the in the grass just for shits and giggles. Fucking more money I gotta spend to fucking fix a tire. Alright. G'day guys, um, so at the moment we're at the Golgong house and we're doing some more renovations. I mowed the lawn as you saw at the beginning of the video. Mowed the lawn, got a flat tyre, got the, t the tyres off and um, it's being fixed at the moment. So what I'm going to do at the moment is I'm going to show you the house. So um, we will go walk through the house. Uh, and uh, though I'm just gonna block this off for a second. Hang on. Oh, it's blurry. Did I just blur that up? Something shocking. Hang on. Let's get some light. <laughs> hey guys. So um, I'm gonna show you the work that we have done since the last video. Um, so we're just gonna do a walkthrough. Okay. All right. So we've finished off the ceiling in the nook. In the foyer, the um, this is where you can put your keys. Um, not this. This is just there for now because we don't have internet here. Um, but there we go. And then we have a, a jacket rack. It's probably called something else, but I can't think of what it's called right now. <laughs> um, so this is the entrance in through to the house with two big barn sliding doors on either side. So we have bedroom one. So walk in. There's got air conditioning in here and bedroom one. A little sunroom where you could put your bed potentially or either side could have wardrobes. But nice sun can come through here and brighten up this room. 
There's also a couple of shelves in here as well. One here and one there. Uh, and it's a mess at the moment because we're still working a little bit. But this is another little closet area that has um, hanging space, some shelves, um, some space up there to put stuff. And then you have this little room in the front. Another sunroom. Um, you could put a wardrobe there or have this as a computer room or study. We'll go into the second room now. This is number two. Two is just a little bit smaller. Has the same kind of sun for, sunroom as the front. Um, but uh, nice high ceilings. Nice bright room. And this, this room has a walk-in wardrobe. So here you'll hang all your clothes. You've also got the same kind of cupboard that has hanging space in here as well as shelves. You could put your computer in here or just uh, a couch or whatever, reading room, put a library in here. Could be anything you want it to be. Uh, okay, so we'll go on to the kitchen. Here's the kitchen. I don't care about copyright, but I will turn it down just a tad. I will turn it down though, um, but uh, we got a little area here for either alcohol or whatever you want to put in there. Um, on this side we have uh, original wallpaper that originally was on the house, which was actually back there. Um, the wall was here uh, and you know it was it was behind a lot of other stuff that was there got another one this side here it was ripped a little bit hey it gives it uh, a bit of style a bit of quirkiness anyway there's room for a big fridge here plus maybe a smaller either smaller fridge or freezer um, or bins, you could put your bins there. Uh, we have a dishwasher and a nice big sink. And the sink goes under there as well. I don't know if we can get under there. There we go. There's under there too. Um, this comes out, this slides. So you could have that side, that side. Little side on this. Um, nice, nice cupboard space. And drawers for... You know, all that kind of stuff. A nice big pantry in here. Either side. Uh, we've got shelves shelving up here and three pendulum lights to brighten up the kitchen. Um, then we have um, gas stove, gas oven. Um, it's a place where you could put your microwave, either that side or this side. Um, and we have drawers on this side. Uh, coffee station is, is where I usually put my do my coffee and that. Or this could be another place where you could put a microwave with power just there. Alright, so we have raked ceilings. So it's raked and it comes down to where the old box gutter used to be. Um, behind that is the box gutter, the old box gutter we couldn't remove. Through this way, we have the laundry with only option to have a front loader washing machine. Uh, you could put a dryer up here, you got cupboard space up here and down here with a sink as well. And power. Another linen closet, which we still. Oh, crap. 
need to work with. Oh, that needs to be glued. Have you? Have are you gluing it? Yeah. Okay. Um, this is another where you could put your brooms, your vacuum cleaner. Which we don't really need a vacuum cleaner. There's no carpet in here, but it's still good to have one. This is the living room where we're actually sleeping at the moment because we're using the bedrooms and it's too cold and stuff. But well, it's actually spring now, so it's getting warmer. A nice fireplace that we have here. A nice window to leave, uh, let some uh, breeze through and sunlight. Um, nice tiling for the hearth for the fireplace. All the cornices, uh, all the all the trims, everything is done in here, uh, except for paint. We need just, just we're getting ready for paint. Nearly finished with all the trimmings. Uh, we've done it all through here. We've done everything this side of the house. We're just finishing off ah! this room, which we today, today we started the cornices from there. Right across, right across to that point there, we just have to do this part here um, and that part there at a later date because we still need to do this wall uh, for the closet that's in this room. Uh, so hanging space on that side, nice um, space up there where you can put stuff and shelves. Through here, it's a tight squeeze, I'm just got to make sure I don't knock anything over. Oh, Jesus! All right, so we have a nice shower in here. So this is the ensuite for this room. Nice vanity and and open for um, medicine cabinet. Uh, we have uh, finished with the entrance ray, which this door will open inwards um, on here. Hopefully, it'll open inwards. Yeah, we need to try and get it open inwards. Um, to have shelving along here and another coat, uh, sorry, another um, hanging space for here. Uh, toilet, nice window, uh, nice lighting, fan up here, exhaust fan. And we've finished all the trimming off in here as well. Just got to get to paint. <sighs> nice towel rack on the side through here as well. The only thing there will not be a door here going into as this is the master bedroom and it doesn't need a door. Alright. The only other room we haven't looked at is the last room here which is the bar main bathroom with a nice big tub. Uh, Nice uh, looking toilet with vanity and also same as the other room with medicine cabinet and nice shower with rainfall uh, shower head. And there we have it. Uh, nice wood floors through here as well. The nice grated um, uh, metal thing ah this is what we've also added so we've added a uh, heater um, and also the fan exhaust fan for up here as well uh, these lights do not work um, I don't know what we're gonna do with them probably not take them out let's leave them there the only lights in here that work are these um, so this works and it's uh, bonus for the bathroom as it does get cold in here at winter um, right so I think that's pretty much it um, I'll just give you a little look outside uh, we have some nice lavender plants out in the front that go along the side of the uh, front of the um, house um, uh, it's nice and smelly um, and that's it. Well, thanks for watching. Um, I'll see you guys in another vlog at another point in time. Um, other than that, 
uh, I'll get to editing this and uh, I'll see you guys on the flip side. Ciao, bye. Thank you.